Village life in Ukraine. What people are doing here? How they are living here? Interesting? So stay tuned with us. Hi guys, my name is Anastasia and welcome to Ukraine Life. Guys, do me a favor, subscribe to our channel simply clicking on the subscribe button lower right under this video, so you'll never miss our new live episodes, which we are doing for you every Saturday and Sunday at 10 a.m. Eastern Time. So guys, today uh, we have got some, you know, special video about village life in Ukraine. Today we uh, come to Bezdrik, it's a village in Sum region. It's rather big village uh, and uh, here you can see different houses, old-fashioned, uh, really new ones and it's really great that uh, nowadays uh, people can uh, really live good in such villages. So, guys, today is really cold, it's like real autumn now, so it's uh, about 10 degrees above zero, so it's really pretty cold. And that's why uh, there are not so many people in the streets. But uh, today I am uh, going to try to show you uh, all the magic of uh, village life. So, by the way, guys, you see behind me it's a village library. So, uh, you can come here, read some books, uh, take them home, uh, read to your children, read uh, uh, for the night. So, it's really great that uh, in village people can educate, people can read uh, uh, what they like and uh, not only some old Babushka's books, yeah, grandmother's books, some stuff. And here also grocery. It's called Tamara. By the way, Tamara it's a Ukrainian lady name. And a really interesting fact that uh, it's usual thing that in village uh, people named uh, sorry for such people named uh, uh, groceries, shops, cafes by the name of uh, by the women's name it's not tamara natasha katerina so it's really interesting uh, effect uh, you can see yes yeah, so in village a little dog can just run uh, near you hi sweetie <laughs> yeah, maybe just afraid of english <laughs> so uh, what people are doing here of course, they have got uh, pets, yeah? Uh, in some uh, old times, people usually had uh, pigs, cows, goats. It's really interesting. I even remember that uh, my grandmother had a big pig and I always liked to uh, feed it. <laughs> uh, but. Nowadays, unfortunately, all youth uh, go to the big cities, they left villages, uh, that is why uh, yeah, old men uh, and women, uh, it's hard for them to uh, take care after uh, big pets, after pigs, cows, so uh, nowadays they have got only uh, like chickens, uh, yeah, a goose, uh, uh, Sometimes, yeah, it may be goats, but it's really a rare thing. So, you see, uh, there are many different buildings. Uh, here you can even found uh, uh, Ukraine Post. It's uh, with the help of which you can send uh, letters to your relatives, to your friends. Uh, you can order some stuff. Yeah, from internet, but about internet, if you uh, someday will come to the village, to, re to, to the really deep village, unfortunately, uh, you won't found, uh, find here uh, internet, because it's really bad connection here. Yeah, it's really a big minus for 21st century. Do you agree with me, guys? So, uh, by the way, guys, uh, feel free, put your comments below this video. You can ask us different questions about village, about uh, uh, people who live in the village, uh, of course, about Ukrainian ladies, 
and maybe you want to discuss some topic please also feel free put your favorite topic below in the comments and uh, maybe next video will be on your topic so you can see i think uh, this is also some uh, like state building with the ukrainian flag you see it's really a uh, modern yeah with uh, good repayment uh, with ukrainian flag so uh, by the way also bus station so if you don't have a car you need to stay here and wait for a bus to go to the town to the sumi uh, yes people here have got gardens where they grow up uh, uh, vegetables fruits yeah uh, they have got chicken so this is their meat but uh, in general uh, people need to go to sumi to buy new clothes uh, to really buy uh, many grocery because you saw this uh, small grocery shop what you can buy here only maybe a uh, uh, one bread milk and that's all that is why people need to go to the town so you can see yes yeah, so really different buildings old here you can see that uh, some people built a new house for themselves and i think that uh, this is own uh, built by himself so it's really interesting uh, and really uh, usual stuff in uh, villages that uh, you can see on the streets not <coughs> sorry guys not cats or dogs but uh, you can see here chickens and goose right on the streets so uh, and uh, i saw a little chicken uh she is yeah Ah, and here, yeah, you can see chickens, uh, they just uh, uh, try to find to eat something, so, uh, and you see, it's like, uh, yeah, they just afraid, and it's just like a house for them, then it's not so cold yet. Yeah, so, it's village life, it's really interesting, and, uh, uh, but in general, you can see, these roads uh, really uh, become here by car and it was really uh, sometimes it was a pretty terrible road really uh, and uh, our government don't want uh, to help village people to make their village really better so yeah this is problem of uh, our country of uh, our region i think government should take care after uh yeah it's a nation after its people and uh, you see yeah this road is really terrible uh, if you come here by car uh, your car can be <laughs> crashed <laughs> so and here also you see it's like an iron, uh, another kind of chickens by the way, guy, guys, yeah, there are many kinds of chickens. It's like uh, dogs, yeah, we have got different car, yeah, different breeds, yeah, different breeds. So, also chickens with uh, different, uh, in different color, different breeds. It really can be interesting. So, if you're interested in it, so just Google it. You, I think you will really find it interesting. You see guys unfortunately it's really become uh, cold uh, that is why uh, there are not so many people on the streets but usually a uh, village it is uh, many children uh, many babushkas it's uh, in just like this near their their yards yeah just sit here have a talk have a talk about what about pets about garden about potatoes <laughs> yes <Yeah>, so <laughs> it's really uh, their usual stuff guys you see it's not three really not three so you can just take it from the tree and eat <laughs> but first you need to dry it yes 
Yeah, you see here is really pretty old house, old fashioned, yeah, with uh, uh, not so not so good looking, but there are also, you see, uh, many small chickens. Let's come closer, maybe, to see more. Yeah, you see, it's, there are not so many pets here, as I said. Uh, yeah, no cows, cows now, no. Oh, what's a beautiful chicken. <laughs> yeah, so uh, nowadays uh, there are not so many cows, goats uh, stayed in the uh, village. Uh, yes, maybe in some, in some really deep, deep, deep villages uh, there are many uh, uh, such big pets, yeah? But, uh, yeah, because uh, youth uh, just go to the town, stay there because of study, because of work, and uh, they have no time to help their uh, grand relatives uh, to look after big pets. Uh -huh. You see, babushkas just uh, relax on the seats here yeah, with the cats so it's really beautiful Dobry den Jak ваши справы? Нам сказали, у вас дорогу только сделали, да? Це ми знімаємо для іноземців показуємо просто, як живуть люди в селі Та що, красиві, все нормально Ні! А ви, а ви бабушка ж just shy, because uh, they need to take care of themselves, yeah, to make some makeup. <laughs> And they ask to take them to your home country. <laughs> you see how beautiful Kitty. His name is Tosha. Pretty boy. <laughs> Красунчик такий. <laughs> Обязательно, да. Guys, really, I, uh, if you come to Ukraine, I uh, really recommend you not to visit, you know, some uh, uh, churches, yeah, some typical touristic places, but visit such villages. It will be really interesting for you because our people, they are really friendly. You see, we don't know these babushkas, but we can just talk with them about how the things are going, about their garden, so just in general about some stuff. And I think for you it will be really interesting experience. So just try it, don't be afraid really, because Ukrainians really friendly nation and uh, we always uh, happy to make uh, new friends uh, maybe to make new relatives yes guys <laughs> so just come and visit ukraine would it be kiev odessa lviv or bezdrik it will be ukraine great country with great people and of course with beautiful ukrainian ladies so guys and thank you that you were with me today guys don't forget to click on notification bell button to not miss our new live episodes which we are doing for you every saturday and sunday at 10 a.m eastern time thank you guys and have a good day bye bye